Hi guys, this is Jolt. In today's video, we are going to check out how this BWT aqua test um, working for testing the hardness of the water. First, I'm going to just, let's say, unbox it to see what is inside. And then um, we are going to try it on soft water and hard water. So let's kick it. In the box there was the instruction, a vessel to put the water in, a liquid marked uh, with the letter A and the liquid marked with the letter B. From the top I need to run the water for around a minute, then fill, it, fill the vessel up to the marker. Then from the A um, marked liquid I need to put two drops in this mixture and I need to shake it. And then from the B liquid I need to start to add drop by drop. First when I put these two drops in the water it will go like uh, let's say red and then I will need to start to count how many drops I had to add from the transparent liquid and that gives us the hardness level. So let's do it. Oops, silly me, I just watched it before I um, recorded the English version, but anyhow, you've seen the color change. So after two drops from the transparent, it went blue from purple. Uh, just in case I added the third one, if it is changing anything in the color, but no, it, it, it didn't. So it has like a two hardness level and here it is like number two, come on, focus. Anyhow, so it's level two uh, in the this German scale of water hardness. Now I washed it, quickly rinsed it, and um, I have now the hard water in it. So we are going to check that one out. Yeah, so I'm going to add again two drops from the A liquid and then start to count the B liquid, how many drops I had to use.
So I had to add 15 drops of the B liquid. It means that it's this German hardness level 15. Uh, I'm not sure how much will be visible because of the focusing. But uh, yeah, it's, it's a rather hard water. And it became level 2. So that's how the BWT aqua test works. That concludes the video. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and press the notification bell so you're not going to miss any of my upcoming videos. I'd like to say a big thank you for your time and catch you on the next one. Bye bye. Oops, before we all run away, just a quick note and warning. You need to be careful how you store these water tests. It cannot be stored at too cold or too hot places, otherwise it will be spoiled and you won't be able to use it. It's not going to show the uh, right figures.